여러분 안녕하십니까? 반갑습니다. Uh, I'm very happy to meet you uh, talking about uh, civil society uh, in Korea. I mean uh, South Korea. Uh, what I'm going to talk uh, today uh, talk about today is the, the dynamics of uh, civil society uh, in Korea. Civil society is uh, dynamic uh, in the sense that the uh, uh, citizens have become uh, very active. Uh, you know, citizens, they, uh, uh, you know, make the, their own civil society, uh, both online and offline. Uh, however, civil society uh, in Korea is also counter-dynamic, even hyper-dynamic, in the sense that uh, uh, civil society is highly divided up. Uh, it's civil society organizations, uh, uh, pro pro progressive and uh, conservative ones, are opposed to each other. Uh, so uh, there is a high degree of the uh, political hate and uh, uh, social distrust, uh, distrust in, in civil society. Uh, I'm uh, worrying about that, uh, uh, that those increasing social conflicts might be lead uh, the uh, breakdown of uh, uh, the democracy in Korea. I'd like to I'd like to uh, briefly outline uh, my presentation today. Uh, I'll give you uh, uh, the general picture of civil society and uh, uh, its organizations. Uh, then I will examine current state of civil society organizations. Uh, lastly, I look at changing relationship between the state and civil society. You know, this year is a terrible one of suffering and sorrow, uh, watching uh, helplessly the spread of the uh, COVID-19 in every corner of the world. So far, 1.2 million deaths out of the uh, 50 million infected. Uh, Korea has been doing well. Uh, the U.S. Uh, Assistant Secretary uh, for Health, uh, Mr. Jirua, said everyone talks about Korea being the standard. However, uh, we should be careful since COVID-19 uh, might resurge anytime until the development of vaccines and medicine. Uh, you know, uh, civil society uh, is robust, uh, I mean uh, strong, becoming strong and sound. Uh, there was no, you know, have been no buying fever or anti-mask protest uh, during the pandemic. Uh, citizens have been willing to co cooperate with government for the sake of their uh, health uh, and safety. Uh, <coughs> The government has uh, established, I would say, close cooperation with civil society uh, to build pandemic prevention, detection, and treatment system. Uh, so there is, a, you know, a criticism uh, in that the uh, NGO, uh, you know, NGO should be a non-profit, non-government, non-political. Uh, but today, NGO has become a new government office. Uh, it's interesting, okay? Uh, so I would say that the uh, uh, credibility and influence of the uh, civil society uh, organizations have declined. Okay, I don't have the uh, recent data. Uh, it, it is the uh, uh, it, it 19, uh, I mean, two, 2013, the year 2013 uh, uh, is the latest one. Uh, I'm not sure uh, you can uh, read Korean, uh, uh, however, but, uh, uh, you know, uh, could you guess uh, who is most, uh, uh, you know, reliable in Korea? Uh, look at, look at, you know, this table. And who would be uh, most influential? Look at this table, okay? Uh, It is interesting to uh, point out 
that the uh, in terms of reliability, uh, I mean, big companies, a conglomerate, are very high. Uh, while civil society organizations are low. Uh, in particular, political parties are very low. Okay. Then what about the uh, influence? In terms of influence, uh, conglo uh, conglomerate are also uh, high. Uh, but uh, uh, civil society organization is uh, 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 relatively low. Uh, so I would say that the uh, Korean civil society right now is facing uh, new challenges. Uh, what I'm saying is that the civil society is changing very rapidly. Uh, citizens have become active in expressing ideas and organizing protests. They have formed, uh, they have emerged to form the so-called tertiary civil sector. In the past years in Korea, uh, there are there were civil movements, but uh, uh, there are not there were not many citizens uh, who participated in uh, social movement. Right now, uh, civil society organizations uh, are in weak position, in the sense that they are losing members loyal to organizations. So, uh, you know, in Korea. Uh, civil movement with the citizens are uh, uh, changing to civil society organizations without members. So uh, look at uh, the uh, uh, this table uh, again, okay? Uh, then uh, I'm not uh, sure uh, uh, whether you are familiar with you know, Korean civil society organizations. I think that uh, uh, there are about uh, uh, 100,000 civil society organizations, but most of them uh, are not active. Uh, 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 they, are, uh, they were established uh, for the purpose of uh, a personal or political interest. Uh, and uh, I would say that uh, uh, there are uh, non-profit corporate body uh, 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 number 22,000. Uh, I, uh, uh, you know, uh, 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 include the, those uh, special uh, corporate body in the area of medical medicine, uh, schools, and welfare. Uh, among the uh, non-profit corporate body, I would say that there uh, would be about 10,000 uh, civil society organizations that are active. Uh, as I already said, uh, you know, civil society organization should be uh, non uh, non uh, political, non you know uh, profit, right? They sh should maintain distance uh, from government business. Uh, it's important for them to uh, maintain the uh, independence and autonomy. Uh, so in relation with the government, uh, the, the civil society organization uh, should be in country uh, or should be cooperation. So, uh, uh, you know, uh, I would say uh, some, uh, uh, some kind of uh, sort of the uh, complete, uh, complete cooperation uh, between uh, government and civil society organizations. There are many uh, terminology uh, uh, reporting, uh, you know, civil society organizations. I think the uh, NGO or, or the most popular, okay, non-government organizations, and uh, we also uh, use uh, 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 the NPO, non-profit organization, and there are many, many, many. Uh, uh, you know, in general, uh, we can, uh, you know, report. Uh, all the, uh, uh, the organizations uh, active in civil society, uh, civil society organization. But the terminology uh, are different uh, uh, from country to country. Uh, I'd like to uh, 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 remind you of the uh, one special NGO, that is NGI, non-governmental individual. Uh, 
uh, uh, I had a chance to visit uh, Leverkusen in Germany, and uh, I found that uh, there is a, a you know NGI uh, that stages the uh, uh, protest against the uh, barrier. You know, Bayer is very famous for the aspirin, right? Uh, but uh, some of the products, like the uh, pesticides and fertilizers, are harmful uh, to uh, human. So uh, uh, she, uh, you know, organized an NGO called uh, CABD, Coalition Against Bio Danger. Right now, uh, they changed the name. She changed the name, something like. Uh, 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 C coalition uh, against fire, CAP, or something like that. Okay, so there are many, uh, you know, uh, terminology uh, different from uh, country to country. Uh, there are, uh, uh, you know, some interesting uh, concept uh, uh, that would be bingo, twingo, or primgo. Uh, what is meant by bingo? Uh, you know, some angel people are interested in uh, enjoying drinking beer after the uh, ceremony or meeting, okay? So we call uh, beer, beer bingo. And some members are interested in free travel, uh, you know, supported by government or business. So uh, I uh, 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 use the uh, uh, chingo, okay? That then another, uh, you know, uh, the, the CEO, uh, civil society organization uh, is flamingo. Some, you know, members are interested in taking picture uh, for or, or uh, uh, the uh, future entrance to politics. Okay. Uh, then uh, we can use, you know, uh, different, you know, terminology. Okay, but they are almost same to each other. Uh, so NGOs are uh, usually uh, uh, NGOs are uh, the general uh, you know definition to cover the uh, so civil society organizations, and that there are some essence of NGOs, the best part of NGOs, that they are called SMO, social movement organizations, uh, that aims at changing the society. Uh, they want to change the existing power structure or uh, economic system. So uh, in social science literature, they usually use SMO rather than NGO, okay? And there are uh, many uh, NGOs uh, that are active in uh, international society. We call them uh, INGOs, okay? INGOs. Then uh, we can also uh, pick out the TSMOs, okay? Transnational social movement organizations. Uh, I'm wondering if uh, you are familiar with the Korean NGOs. It's, uh, you know, you know, uh, it's, uh, uh, you know, uh, logo, I mean, identification, uh, uh, NGO identification. Uh, you can see Chameyonde, uh, Chameyonde, people, solidarity, for participatory democracy, okay? And uh, uh, it is, uh, citizens coalition uh, for economic justice. Okay, there are many, many angels. Then uh, I can also, uh, you know, uh, uh, pick up the uh, Korean Federation of Environment Movement. Okay, and they can be called NGOs or civil society organization, but uh, some of them can be called uh, called. SMO, social movement organization, such as Chameyonde, Gyeongsilyeon, Hanyeongdongnyeon. Okay. Then how about how about the uh, INGOs? Okay. Uh, there are many, uh, you know, INGOs. Uh, 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 you know, uh, uh, Greenpeace, uh, Friends of Us are working on environment, and uh, uh, Amnesty, Amnesty. Uh, on uh, uh, you know human rights and ATA uh, or Oxfam is interested in you know uh, third world development. Okay, then uh, they uh, could be classified. Uh, some of them could be classified as uh, 
uh, transnational social movement organization. I think uh, uh, I can pick up Greenpeace or you know, Amnesty. Uh, they, they are the uh, best of the uh, essence of the INGOs. Uh, okay. Uh, then let's move on to uh, current state of civil society uh, organizations in Korea. Uh, in Korea, uh, civil society organizations have grown since the late 1980s. So as I already told you, uh, there are about 100,000 uh, organizations active in civil society. Uh, the reason is that uh, uh, civil society organization have been supposed to play a quasi-party role since the party politics are very weak in terms of interest mediation. Uh, but uh, uh, civil society organizations have contributed uh, to uh, the extending of the uh, political participation of the citizens. But uh, some of you know leaders uh, have also shown uh, too much uh, you know power oriented uh, posture. So uh, I would say that the, uh, the that kind of uh, political orientation of some members of the uh, civil society organization uh, have damaged the, uh, the, the independence and autonomy of the civil society organization. So I would say that uh, civil society organizations have to uh, keep distance from government and business. Uh, they have to try, uh, you know, uh, keep your autonomy, okay, from uh, not only from uh, government, but from uh, business. Uh, you know, uh, American democracy is now in trouble. Uh, uh, you know, uh, it's not the topic uh, we are interested in uh, today, but uh, uh, what is the uh, uh, secret of democracy uh, in America? Uh, uh, you know, let's take an example of the democracy in America. Uh, uh, Dockville, uh, long time ago, Dockville uh, told us that uh, why France underwent the revolution, but America did not. Then why America could establish democracy? Very important question. This, the, the secret of democracy lies in art of association. It is civil associations that we activated individual citizens in America. You know, uh, citizens are likely to be important under mass democracy, but they became into active citizens through the uh, uh, mediation of uh, voluntary uh, civil associations and uh, active participation of citizens in community affairs, uh, private interests of citizens could coincide with the public in interest of communities. Uh, that is the secret of democracy uh, in America, okay? Uh, as I've to uh, already told you, uh, uh, we have the 2015 statistics. Uh, there are more than 20,000 uh, uh, non profit corporate bodies. Okay? And uh, 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 as far as the, uh, uh, the civil you know, uh, society association that are non profit are concerned, we have the, uh, about uh, uh, more than uh, 13,000 uh, 13, uh, organizations. Okay? So uh, I'd like to look at uh, the major characteristics of, the characteristics of Korean uh, civil society organization uh, in many aspects. Uh, most of the uh, uh, you know, uh, civil society organizations are uh, located in, you can see, as you can see, Seoul and Gyeonggi-do. You know, Korea is composed of nine prefectures, okay? They're mostly in, in uh, to prefecture. Uh, although Seoul is a special city, Gyeonggi-do is a, a prefecture. Then how about, you know, uh, 
Jeju-do. Uh, Sejong is a special city, so uh, you cannot uh, uh, talk about that. But how about Jeju-do? There, there, are, there is a small number of, you know, uh, civil society organizations. Uh, then in which area, uh, you know, uh, civil society organizations uh, uh, are working on? Uh, mostly, uh, they uh, are related, uh, their activities are related to welfare. Uh, next to welfare is environment. And uh, volunteer uh, is also important sector. Okay. Uh, as I told you, uh, Korean have uh, NGOs, uh, Korean civil society organizations uh, have begun to grow since the late uh, 1980s. And most of civil society organizations uh, were established uh, in early 10s, 10 down, 2000, okay, 2000. Uh, so you can see the uh, finding year uh, by the uh, sector, uh, almost the same. Then how about the um, uh, size of membership, uh, about membership? Uh, the, the, you know, average uh, member, average number of member uh, is about 15,000, okay? Small in number. Uh, and, Large numbers can be found in the area of fundraising uh, or a women's uh, organization uh, or, and, and uh, uh, welfare in the area of welfare of news children. Uh, they have the, uh, you know, large memberships. Uh, then how about the uh, uh, yearly budget? Uh, Average, uh, uh, average, uh, you know, uh, 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 the, the amount of the yearly budget uh, uh, is uh, about uh, 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 half million dollars. Uh, it's uh, 500, uh, you know, uh, uh, 500 million one, but uh, it amounts to, that amounts to a half million dollars, uh, okay? Uh, Korean civil society organizations and, and ha have some affiliations. Uh, most of the affiliated organizations, uh, uh, as you can see, uh, the service centers, okay? Uh, and uh, their activity types are, are, are concentrate in the area of research, data collection, uh, and policy making, uh, uh, followed by social service for minority and education and training. Okay, uh, and we can compare the uh, uh, activities uh, uh, by five movement sector. Uh, I mean, environment, political economy, culture, welfare, youth, and children. So you can see uh, the, uh, it, those activities. Uh, and Korean civil society organizations are making a NATO uh, very actively. Uh, at grass uh, root, uh, that, you know, uh, welfare organizations uh, or uh, educational research organizations are, are very much, uh, you know, positive, aggressive in making NATO. And they make also uh, NATO at local level. You know, welfare uh, organizations are also uh, very, uh, uh, you know, uh, proactive. Uh, at the national level, uh, also, uh, you know, welfare organizations uh, are very much active. Then, what about the, uh, at the Asian and regional level? Uh, education, and research area is uh, active, and volunteer uh, area is also very active in networking. Uh, however, however, at international level, networking is not uh, strong. Uh, you know, in case of environment, you know, 
the cooperation uh, in the area of environment is very important uh, in uh, this time of the uh, climate change. But uh, we can find small, you know, uh, case of uh, networking and a small case of networking. But welfare in the area of welfare, uh, they they do they do some uh, networking. Okay. Then what about the uh, uh, cooperation with the government? Uh, you know, uh, welfare organization uh, need a lot of money. Uh, I think that's why uh, they uh, yeah very uh, uh, you know active in cooperation with, with the government. Uh, and uh, uh, youth uh, children uh, organizations are very much uh, cooperative with the business. I think uh, they uh, uh, need some uh, you know business donation. I think. Uh, then how about the uh, cooperation in academia? Uh, you know, uh, uh, to be sure, education research uh, 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 organizations are uh, active, and women's uh, organizations are also uh, active. Then what about the chairperson's occupation? Most of chairpersons uh, uh, have the background of the uh, uh, professors or uh, lawyers, okay? I used to be uh, a co-chair of the uh, 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 Citizens Coalition uh, for Economic Justice. And I'm, I'm from, uh, you know, I, 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 I'm, I'm from, uh, you know, the, the university, right? So most of the uh, chairperson come from the uh, uh, universities or legal uh, affair. Then about the uh, uh, Secretary General's past career, uh, they used to, uh, you know, work in the area of civil movements, okay? So Secretary General's used to be an activist and they, uh, it, 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 you know, are doing, uh, you know, secretary, they are taking a job of the secretary general uh, in civil society organizations. Then how, how about the secretary general's education? Uh, I don't think it's, uh, it's, it's meaningful because uh, most of the, uh, you know, uh, uh, this responses are missing. Huh? Uh, so uh, I think it's, it's meaningless to talk about that. Uh, Okay, then what about the step size? Uh, you know, average uh, number of steps amounts to uh, around uh, four or five people, okay? The small, they have the small step member. Uh, then you can see the uh, uh, age uh, uh, of the Secretary General in sector. Uh, that can be found uh, you know, much difference. The mean age is uh, about 49 years, okay, old. Uh, then how, how about the uh, financing? They usually uh, finance through special uh, patronage uh, uh, event, uh, or they, uh, you know, raise funds uh, online, okay? Uh, what, uh, you know, they make use of the personal network in financing. Uh, and you can see the uh, source of the, uh, you know, uh, uh, financing. Uh, uh, you know, most of Korean uh, civil society organizations uh, rely on uh, membership fees, okay? And uh, they participate in, uh, you know, government supported, uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, the, the, the problems. Huh? Okay. Uh, so uh, we can see uh, most of the uh, uh, budget uh, come from uh, uh, membership fees. Okay. Uh, then, what about the annual budget? Uh, is, you know, average annual budget uh, 
is counted uh, as the uh, uh, quarter million dollars, the quarter million dollars, about quarter million dollars. And most of the budget are used uh, in the area of the, uh, uh, you know, uh, special event uh, uh, in terms of the publication uh, uh, or education. Uh, and, 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 and some other important portion uh, uh, are used uh, in the early area of you know, uh, personal expenses. Then how can he, uh, they uh, you know, make decisions in uh, distributing uh, uh, the budget, annual budget? Usually uh, they, make, uh, they make a decision uh, in, through uh, executive committee, okay? Executive committee. Uh, and according to statistics, uh, Korean civil society organizations have their own accountants. accountants. And uh, uh, most of them uh, have, uh, you know, audit, uh, uh, regular audit, audit system in, in terms of the accounting. Uh, <clears throat> uh, it is important. Uh, one, uh, you know, uh, as I already told you, uh, uh, Korean civil society organizations uh, rely on uh, membership fees, and uh, uh, those uh, who pay membership fees are about uh, six, uh, 60 uh, percent. Okay. Okay, then uh, I move on to the uh, changing relation between the state and civil society. Uh, it it, it uh, would be the most important part of my uh, presentation. Okay, how is civil society? How is civil society? Mm -hmm. Civil society uh, is a social space here. Voluntary association seek to shape the rules that govern social life. Uh, civil society organization bring together people who share concerns about a particular policy area problem. So civil society organizations are integral to civil society. Uh, but uh, uh, civil society organizations vary uh, enormously in organizational form, geographical scope, resource level, constituencies, and strategy and tactics. Uh, Yet the uh, uh, all civil society uh, is, uh, activities are voluntary. So civil society uh, 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 organizations are actively political, since they affect the way the social power is distributed and exercised. Uh, so uh, I would say, uh, and I, I would say not all civil society organizations are equally committed to the values of freedom, equality, welfare, and so on, okay? Uh, I'd like to uh, 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 talk, uh, 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 point out uh, two more things in characterizing civil society. I already talked talk about the network civil society organization, okay? Uh, they are integral to civil society. Uh, another important, uh, you know, uh, characteristics of civil society is that uh, civil society organization function as social capital. What is then social capital? Social capital facilitates coordination and cooperation for mutual benefits for citizens. Uh, composed of the norms and trust, social capital facilitates communication and interactions that allow the limits of collective action to be resolved. Uh, another thing I'd like to add is the uh, uh, public sphere, okay? Uh, public sphere is also integral to civil society. Uh, public sphere provides social dialogue necessary for the shared values and interests among citizens. It is very much essential for shaping public opinion that passes uh, increasing state accountability, okay? Uh, and a public sphere refers to an enlightened 
political random social life in which public opinion can be formed. It has emerged in advanced capitalism, under which social and political rights are united to all classes, including not only bourgeois, but also the mass workers and peasants. So, public sphere works for the general interest of the public who seek to limit the authority of the state on the basis of principle uh, uh, of public accountability. Uh, and uh, uh, one of the important aspects of the uh, public sphere is that the uh, uh, it, it is a sort of community communicative action that is indispensable for generating uh, consensus in large. Uh, you know what is meant by old media and new media, okay? Uh, telegraph, telephone, film, radio, TV, recorder, satellite TV. They, they can be called old media, but, uh, you know, CD, table, PC, history, smartphone, YouTube, they are surely new media, right? So it is very important to analyze the role of media in the formation of development public sphere uh, in, in Korea. Uh, especially the increasing role is played by the personal telecommission media. Uh, 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 it, 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 that, uh, that is, uh, uh, you know, uh, I, I mean, uh, uh, social media. In Korea, we, uh, we call uh, social, them, uh, we call it the social network service, such as the Facebook, Kakao, the WhatsApp, Instagram, uh, uh, and so on, okay? Uh, then let's think about the uh, state society, society relations, okay? Uh, what is the state? State is uh, based on the principle of rational legal bureaucratic norms and rule of law. So state uh, refers to three branches of executive, legislature, and uh, judiciary. Uh, civil society uh, uh, refers to family, interest groups, voluntary uh, association, and civil society organization, and so on. And they follow the principle of freedom of association expression. The reason I uh, 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 talk about uh, state society relation is that uh, it, it, is, it, it, is, it can be supposed that the uh, relationship between the state and civil society uh, would be relative. If the state would be strong, then civil society would be weak, or vice versa. However, uh, we can uh, suppose that uh, uh, the strong state and uh, you know, strong uh, civil society, or uh, the weak civil society and the weak state, okay? Think about your country you come from. Uh, what about the uh, state social, social relations there, okay? Uh, they are supposed to change and they have changed, okay? Uh, and there are, Four types of interest, media, interest intermediation uh, in, 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 you know, in every country, okay? Uh, usually, uh, political scientists uh, talk about uh, pluralism uh, or corporatism, okay? Uh, the United States and England uh, enjoy pluralism, right? Uh, there are many uh, interest groups. That, that compete each other to influence the government, okay? Then how about co corporatism? In uh, Western uh, European countries like Austria, Swiss, Germany, France, in, in France, uh, they, uh, uh, they uh, you know, uh, uh, is their politics based on social corporatism, okay? Uh, uh, in, in, uh, as compared to uh, social corporatism in uh, some European countries, uh, Latin American countries used to be state corporatists. Then how can uh, uh, we, you know, differentiate uh, those four types of interest mediation? Uh, this, you know, classification uh, is based on a uh, paper uh, co-authored with uh, Kim Byung-gu and 
I, uh, you know, Kim Byung, Professor Kim byung used to be a professor of uh, government at Korea University. And uh, he is a founder of East Asia Institute. Uh, and he and I worked together to classify uh, and, uh, uh, you know, uh, introduce uh, 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 another new type of, of the state society, society relation, that's state monism. In the present literature, literature in the political science, they cannot uh, much talk about state monism, okay? Only pluralism and, and corporatism. Okay, how can flow autonomous or top down, okay? What, uh, you know, uh, uh, labor organizations are concentrated on the uh, you know, government guidance or labor organization dispersed, dispersed. Then Korea uh, used to be, uh, 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 you know, based on state monism. Now it tries to move towards pluralism or social corporatism. Uh, during the Kim Dae-jung government, uh, they wanted to introduce a social corporate, you know, uh, system. Uh, but still, uh, Korea is, uh, you know, uh, in the stages of uh, moving either way, okay? Uh, I, I think uh, I'm uh, behind the schedule, so I'll be, I'll be kicked, okay? I'll be kicked. Uh, Korea used to be uh, characterized by strong state in the civil society. Uh, it is the late 1980s that civil society has begun to grow on a full scale. Uh, as I told you, most of civil society organizations emerged in early 2000. Uh, it has, uh, uh, you know, uh, the civil society organizations have contributed to the enlargement of citizenship and formation of civil society. But civil society organizations are not sufficiently developed, uh, but continue to challenge the state. However, I would say the state is still a dominant actor in organizing economy and society from top down. Uh, that's why I talked about state modism in, in Korea. Uh, not only in Korea, but in China and in Japan, statism is a old tradition uh, and uh, you know top uh, uh, organization uh, labor organizations uh, are not unified together uh, there 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 are uh, you know uh, and Nin no Chong and Changnyeon Union and other things okay so uh, it's not easy to uh, you know uh, uh, to talk about uh, 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 in which way uh, Korea uh, will be uh, moving uh, towards, okay? Uh, okay, I will uh, uh, skip this, this one, this page, but uh, according to uh, Democracy Index, uh, 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 you know, published by economists, you know, uh, uh, research group, uh, there are four types of political regime, full democracy, flow democracy, hybrid democracy, and authority. And which political regime do you think Korea would belong to? <laughs> belong to? Please, please, please say. Uh, they, uh, you know, uh, classify Korea as flow democracy, okay? Uh, Korea have multi-party system and pair election, but uh, democratic rights and uh, rule of law are not good uh, in the sense Korea democracy flow. Okay, uh, you know, uh, I'm pressed for time, but uh, it is very important to uh, think. So I'd like to emphasize for democracy to to deepen civil uh, civil society. A strong civil society, I mean robust, robust civil society required. required. Capital is not possible in the absence of civil society, but democracy is not possible without civil society. 
The existence of civil society is prerequisite not only for the transition to democracy, but also for the deepening of uh, democracy. Uh, okay, time is, uh, 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 I'm, uh, uh, time is running out, so uh, I will uh, you know, focus on a couple of things that are important uh, uh, to uh, my uh, you know, presentation. Uh, to institu institutionalize further civil society, Korea needs to strengthen interest politics among citizens. Uh, unless civil society organizations do not aggregate and represent various interests among uh, diverse social classes and groups, civil society is not capable of channeling them into stating and formulating public policy. Uh, and another thing I'd like to emphasize is the, uh, uh, there has emerged new social movements beginning with the late 1980s. You know, uh, we can talk about all the social movements, okay, based on workers and peasants or urban poor. But there you know, began to emerge uh, uh, a new social movement uh, on the basis of the, uh, the such values, economic justice, women's rights, human rights, environment, or peace. Uh, you know, so new social movement, uh, it, 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 that is a uh, 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 movement that are uh, uh, you know, sometimes called uh, civil movement, are not class center. They are uh, multi class oriented. They are even class coalition. And uh, Citizens Coalition for Economic Justice, Jiang uh, Xilian, you know, open the way in uh, bringing a uh, new social movement in Korea in 1989, okay? Uh, okay, I'll move, uh, okay. Uh, I have to say that uh, uh, to be sure, uh, civil society organizations have played a major role in deepening democracy. Uh, after democratic transition, uh, in addition to social, uh, old social movement, uh, new social movement ha have, have emerged. Uh, so uh, we also need to pay attention to uh, various forms of social movement and jumping increase the number of CSOs. Uh, one of, you know, new social movements is uh, GLBT. Uh, yeah, I think familiar with the gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender movement, okay? Uh, they are influenced by the uh, Vienna World Summit on Human Rights, 1993. Uh, uh, they are framed on human rights and sexual citizenship. And they raise, uh, they continue to raise new issues of identity, culture, and community. They also pay attention to the importance of right to equal access, access to information, freedom, expression among minority. Okay, in closing, uh, I'd like to uh, talk about uh, present situation of uh, uh, civil society and civil society uh, organization in Korea. Uh, I'm, I'm reluctant to say, but Korea still suffer from a high level of protest activities, such as street demonstration, strike, sit-in protest, and candlelight project. Uh, I focus on uh, among other things, candlelight budget. You know, it is, uh, it, it can be, uh, you know, characterized as nonviolent and peaceful demonstration. And I can, uh, you know, uh, take an example of two cases. One is the protest against the importing United States beef in 2008. Uh, almost half a million citizens participate. And another uh, uh, important candlelight project is, uh, uh, is, is uh, uh, you know, uh, protests calling for uh, resignation of President Park Geun-hye between October 2016 and March 2007. Uh, 17 million citizens participate. Amazing. And uh, citizens make use of the wide use of social media to change ideas and to participate in rallies. But uh, there are fake news, disinformation, 
and even news publication. They distort uh, the sound uh, development public sphere. Uh, that's a problem. And uh, uh, there are so-called bar, bar phenomena, bar phenomena. It's difficult to conceptualize, but it's something like uh, fandom in the area of politics. Uh, you know, uh, there are two groups of different ideological and political orientation. Uh, they stage it, uh, initiate and stage it, uh, you know, street demonstration every weekend, uh, one in Sachodong and another in Guam. And they are opposed to each other. Uh, they, they, they are high, there is a high degree of, you know, um, uh, you know mis mistrust uh, between two groups. So this political clavage uh, is challenging to democracy. And uh, I uh, am worrying about uh, the populism might come. Uh, 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 okay, that's what uh, I'd like to uh, talk about uh, today. I'm sorry, I, I could not uh, summarize what I, I have said so far. Thank you very much uh, for coming and talking with you. 감사합니다. 안녕히 계십시오.